Ladywell is a South East London district in the London borough of Lewisham. It merges seamlessly into Brockley, Crofton and Lewisham. After Ladywell Leisure Centre was pulled down in 2014, the council commissioned the use of the land in 2016 with this colourful pop-up village housing 24 homeless people. It will stay here for two more years before they simply dismantle it and move it elsewhere in the borough. This kind of portable village is unprecedented in the UK. H.E. Olby & Co is a family-owned independent builders merchants that has been trading since 1912, offering top quality building supplies. Now, 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 now. The Grade 2 listed Victorian Ladywell Play Tower began life as Ladywell Baths in 1884. Curzon won the bid to refresh the site as a three-screen cinema with new restaurants and housing. Ladywell Station opened in 1857 and 20 years later, major expansion kicked off when they replaced the almost lonesome structure of Bridge House, its accompanying farm and the surrounding wasteland. title Ladywell pretty much explains itself as the original site of Ye Well at Our Lady Eye, the Virgin Mary at Lewisham, or more simply Our Lady's Well, one of two springs on Ladywell Road erected in the late 1400s. Both were considered holy with healing powers. Pilgrims on their way to Canterbury drank from them for medicinal purposes and they were used until 1855 before they were inevitably covered over with development. Ladywell shares the hilly fields park with Broccoli, but has its own exclusive public park in the form of Ladywell Fields. It's made up of three fields, about a mile long collectively, and features the River Ravensbourne, several sport courts, and a popular athletics track used mostly by local schools and clubs. The main shopping area, Ladywell Village, was improved in 2013 using Transport for London funding to make the pavements wider, plant more trees and add parking bays for visitors. The residents of Ladywell tend to be relatively young and well educated. The oldest building in the borough is St Mary's Church. It was also created in dedication to Mary around the same time as her well. The medieval tower section is more than 500 years old.
popular venue for live underground music with an eclectic range of bands to get you moving, the Fox and Firkin will suffice. One night they'll have a dub session and the next night could be a blues band or anything in between. They throw parties and barbecues and have this pizza place in their garden called In It Dough. <laughs> 